Here's the latest on News 12 Long Island. Occupy Wall Street protesters are back in Lower Manhattan's Zuccotti Park, but the scene is far different from what we've seen the last two months. Demonstrators can't lie down to rest because there is a ban on sleeping in the park. After police ousted protesters yesterday, a judge ruled they could go back, but without sleeping bags or tents. President Obama is urging Australian leaders to keep their forces in Afghanistan until the Afghan military takes over in 2014. The president says U.S. troops will increase their presence in Australia from 250 to 2,500 over the next few years. Facebook has been slammed with a porn attack. The social networking site says coordinated spam spam attack is to blame for the posting of pornographic and violent images on users pages. Facebook says most of the material has been removed. It's supposed to be a safe environment for recovering addicts to, trans to transition back to everyday life, but in a special Newsday News 12 investigation, reporter Tom Mayer found that some Sober homes are anything but sober. It's a story you'll see only on 12. Tonight at 5, in part 2 of our series, we'll hear from a mom who lost her son to a drug overdose at a sober home. You can get complete in-depth coverage of the story in today's Newsday. Here's Rich now with a look at your, local hype, at your hyperlocal forecast. No paternity test for, singer star, for singing star Justin Bieber. Here's your entertainment news. Less than two weeks after a California woman claimed that Bieber was the father of her baby, she's reportedly dropped her lawsuit. TMZ also said lawyers for Mariah Yader have quit representing her entirely. The year's sexiest man alive is Bradley Cooper. People Magazine has awarded the actor its annual honor. The 36-year-old Cooper is, is is has dazzling blue eyes, a killer smile, and he seeks fluent French. And want to say goodbye to Regis Philbin in person? Head to the book revenue in Huntington tonight. He'll be talking about his new book, How I Got This Way. Regis wraps up hosting his popular daytime show this Friday. There's a soup, there's a soup out there that can help you fight that winter cold, and it's not chicken noodle. Our Mary Moosey set, shows us today's Long Island naturally. Mary has the butternut squash and fresh ginger soup recipe on her blog. Also watch this weekend for the half hour edition of News of Long Island Naturally. Now a look at some of the stories you'll see during the next half hour. Occupy Wall Street protesters now battling the elements. Life after their tent city was taken down in Zucchini, Zucchini, Ducati Park. <laughs> also, the number of Suffolk cops injured trying to subdue a suspect. Plus, the big turkey drive underway for needy Long Islanders. But first, here's a look at your current weather conditions.